depending on when you're watching, the place you're looking at in the video footage right now may not still be here. This is Levski on Delamar, currently in the Stanton system, and this is Star Citizen, a game which despite being in alpha testing, and despite the controversy it draws, can be incredibly detailed and immersive. And this location spotlight series of videos is to celebrate that beauty. I'm Farrister, and this video will be a location spotlight on Levski in Star Citizen. Aside from the scattered beauty shots throughout, this video will also cover Levski's position in the universe, background lore, as well as some of the services on offer, and as you may be aware, I've included timestamps in the video description to help you find what you're most interested in. Locating Levski so, to stress for this part of the video, the very next patch of Star Citizen at time of recording is expected to temporarily remove Levski before it gets added into the Nyx system. Currently, you'll find Levski on the asteroid-type moon of Delamar in the Stanton system. The landing area itself is a prominent quantum travel destination on the asteroid, with various self-contained hangars, and a huge gaping hole in it from old mining activities. The accessible base is split across multiple levels. Outside the facility itself, there are some visual cues that this is a former mining location, and the whole place has a very industrial, ramshackle feel to it. And background lore. Levski is known to be a little more hostile towards the UEE than most of the other in-game locations. Accordingly, it's a bit of a safe haven for those on the wrong side of the law. Back in 2655, the old mining location became home to various refugees, and the statue to Anthony Tanaka, who died standing up for workers' rights, is a powerful symbol to the political ideology that prevails in Levski. Interestingly, Levski is named after a real person, Vasil Levski, who was a Bulgarian revolutionary who lived in the mid-19th century. It's a really interesting read, and I love that Star Citizen has a little bit of lore which encourages people to find out about our own world history, as well as the in-game. Levski is also home to the so-called People's Alliance of Levski, which could have a video of its own. The People's Alliance reminds me jovially of the People's Front of Judea, in that whilst having a noble goal, they seemingly spend more time debating and disagreeing than actually making any tangible progress. If you agree with that reference, please let me know in the comments. But what services will you find there? So when you first get to Levski, you're greeted by the large ship hangars, which house the landing facilities including refuelling and repair. There are ship spawn terminals for calling your ships. You can also take an elevator up to the surface, where there are multiple garages for spawning ground vehicles. For players who choose, or perhaps more aptly chose, to make Levski their home, there are hubs for spawning in or respawning at. And for those more into trade, at the admin office by the hangar elevators are cargo trading and ore trading consoles. One of the previous hangars has also been repurposed as Teacher's Ship Shop, where you can buy some of the more ramshackle ships, especially those from the Drake line, but also the fearful Vandal Blade. As you descend through the levels, there are a number of other shops, including Cordry's Armour Shop and Conscientious Objects Weapon Store. You'll also find some smaller stalls which sell food, clothes, and crypto keys. And the centre for much of this trade is the Grand Barter Marketplace. There are lots of areas to explore around the former mining base itself, with a maze of tunnels and side rooms. The whole environment is incredibly immersive, and helps with the whole feel of the place as a former mining location. And that pretty much covers the services at Levski. If you've enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing if you'd like to see more Star Citizen location spotlights in the future. And I've included details in the video description for my active Star Citizen organisation. Thank you for watching.